So I got into it pretty much by, by mistake actually by accident. I stumbled across it in secondary school in my first debut production um, of Midsummer Night's Dream, William Shakespeare auditioned and um, was a bit nervous, didn't really know what to expect. I thought I'll give it a go. And I ended up quite fortunately getting one of the um, lead supporting characters in one of the mechanicals, uh, Francis Flew, and um, Thisby, you know, the play in the play, uh, the comedy, and um, got bitten by the bug, um, did it through GCSE, A level. Um, I didn't quite go to drama school, although I always had the ability to go on there to be able to train, but um, I didn't have the luxury of going to drama school, but we didn't quite stop there. Um, did a bit of training at Little Theatre, uh, the Oncastle Little Theatre, uh, did a bit of training there by um, the former artistic director of the LTG, uh, Kevin Spence, it's a great, great bloke, and um, he's a real, real gentleman of a director, he knows his stuff and he's nurtured me along the way, along with the likes of Jan Townend, um, great lady as well, good ethos about JKL, which is another theatre company I'm part of, uh, Len, uh, various people like that. Um, done various shows here at Cast now, live at Cast, in the studio. Um, done, done the recent productions of 511 um, by Edward Kemp about Guy Fawkes and the Gunpowder Plot. Okay, so Dear Connie is a new up and coming mini short film passion project uh, and it features two, two main characters one called Gary, who I play, and there is a, a female part called Connie, who the story is centered around. Uh, it basically sparks two, two genuine people, two childhood sweethearts if you like from school. Although nothing ever did happen in terms of relationship, they were just like, you know, sound genuine mates. Uh, and the role that I'm playing called Gary, he's a bit down and out, he's a bit kind of... Not so much giving up on life, he's looking for a way out, things aren't going quite right for him and he wants to try and get back on the, the path of righteousness. And he goes around to see Connie, who is a good friend of his who he's not seen in a while. But he can't express himself, you know, emotionally, open himself up to express how he truly feels in this moment. So what he does, he writes a letter, hence the dear Connie, that's like the main focal point of the piece. I'll not spoil it for you, though. Um, so he can't express himself, so he mokes himself through a letter. Like he kind of like romanticizes how he feels about this particular point and about his life. So he writes a letter to Connie to sum up how he feels. And um, yeah, it's a nice, light-hearted, fun drama of two characters coming together for the struggles of one's um, down and out life and trying to get back on the path of it all. So yeah, that's Dear Connie. That's gonna be filmed this year in the summer. So watch your space for that. Um, feel free to check out my YouTube channel, Ben Blunt Actor. Um, all the latest happenings on there for you guys, so yeah, watch your space. Thank you for dropping by, appreciate it, and yeah, take care and enjoy life. Cheers.